How's everybody doing tonight? Good. Ready to have some fun? Yeah. Tell them what you finna get, man. What you finna get? Memory right? stick. No doubt memories were made this week when the Oakland Raiders joined their team captain, Kirk Morrison, for his second annual Shop with the Jock event, sponsored by the Kirk Morrison Foundation. Helping uh, 50 kids out, especially, you know, the way our economy is, the way things are going on in the country. If there's any way that I can bring uh, joy to some kids, this, this is the, the event to do it. Let's do some shopping. Those 50 kids currently attend the East Oakland Youth Development Center. I can play basketball in the gym, art class, we like make stuff out of clay, cooking class, we cook all different types of food. The center also serves as a refuge for those less fortunate, a place close to Kirk Morrison's heart. Kirk Morrison, years ago as a teenager, played basketball in our gym. And I think Kirk developed his foundation to give back to the community. And so he sought out the East Token Youth Development Center because it was a very direct connection for him. I just think that uh, kids can kind of look at me and say, you know what, he's from where I'm from. He walked the same streets. And definitely that uh, they can look, they have something to look forward to. While Kirk walked the same streets of Oakland, he also worked hard to attain his goals. Part of the criteria for those chosen to participate in the special evening. The kids that are getting good grades or improving their grades in the homework center or, or um, demonstrating role model behavior, those are who are selected. In true holiday fashion, the Shop with a Jock event profoundly touched the lives of these East Bay kids by supplying a $100 Walmart shopping spree. Now you're more than welcome to buy a gift for someone else, but you have to buy at least one thing for yourself. You know, they don't get the attention that they like at home and things like that, so to feel that they're loved right now I think is the biggest thing that they're happy about. The holiday spirit was abundant and contagious. We've got guys going, oh, can I buy them a XYZ? And I'm like, slow down, they're each allotted $100. You know, it's so hard not to want to give them more because it's such, you know, it's such a moment where the guys really see like there are a lot of needy children out there and it's, it's really great to feel like you've done something worthwhile. You know, going out there and playing on the football field, that's great, but being able to give back to your community and to kids that really need it, that's better. And what could be better than an exclusive evening with your favorite football stars in silver and black? You couldn't do any better. They get to shop for whatever they want. Some of them get to talk to their favorite heroes. And it's all very exciting around the holidays because for many, these will be the only gifts they get. While the kids will have a happier holiday with gift in hand and a lifelong memory, the Raiders walk away with the gift of giving a lifelong lesson. By these guys giving back in their communities, they show these kids that there's a light at the end of the tunnel, there's places for them to go, there's things for them to do, and there's, there's futures for them to have, and I think that's important for them to be able to see that.